Hey, today we're going to talk about how you're going to do printing from your phone if you come in, how you're going to put the mobile print app on your phone. So the first thing that you're going to do on your phone is you're going to go into your settings and you are going to go to where it says cellular and you're going to cut your cellular data off and then you're going to go to the Wi-Fi settings and you're going to join our Wi-Fi LCL001 and the password for that is Lancaster22482 all lowercase. Then what you're going to do is you're going to go to your app store and you're going to search for the Konica Minolta mobile print app. When that comes up, you'll see it and you're going to download that app. Now, I've already downloaded it here on this phone because it can take a few minutes, as you know. So then once the app is downloaded onto your phone, you're going to tap the app. You're going to wait for it to open up. Then you're going to go. It's going to have it up here. Three bars is the menu. And you're going to select print. And then you're going to select where your document is. It's usually in your storage. You can browse, choose your document. Then you're going to go up here. It's going to come up and it's going to ask you to select a printer. So then you're going to hit the plus button up at the top and you're going to tap manual. Then you're going to enter in the IP address of our printer, which is 192.168.1. Point two point four nine. Then tap search. It's going to search and find the Konica Minolta printer, public printer out here. It's going to tell you that the printer has been added. You're going to tap OK. All right. Then you're going to go back. Just tap select printer again. Go back. And then you're going to go back and select your, your document. So we'll go here to storage. We'll browse. We'll just select here a text document. Then we're going to hit the pull down menu. It's a little arrow, and you're going to select how many copies you want one, two, however many. Select color. You're going to select full color or grayscale. Then you're going to go here to details. Then you're going to get a new menu come up. And here you're going to scroll up to where it says output method. For output method, you're going to tap that and select secure print. Then it asks for a secure print ID. So then you're just going to enter in three digits. You can just use one, two, three. Say done, no password, and then you're going to tap print. Then it's going to tell you that the document is being sent over here. You can see it to our copier, which you know. And then what you're going to do on the copier is you're just going to go through like you would normally print a document from the, from the computer. You're going to go over to the document. You're going to select menu, secure print. Then you're just going to, for document ID, you're going to enter in the three-digit code that you entered in. Say one, two, three, no password. Then you're just going to tap OK. Your document's going to show up on the screen, and you're just going to follow through with the printing instructions as normal. And we also have, if you need help, we have the instructions here at the desk that we can hand out to you, and then you'll just return them, and we will re-sanitize them when you're done with them. All right, so hopefully this helps with any questions for printing from your mobile device. Thanks.